Hi guys, good evening. Ginat is without using a tensioner. So I'm using only my fingers to tie with if Ginat guys. So this is a braided line. So this is a cheap braided line. So I'm using this for sake of demonstration only. This green one. Green nylon. So that you can see. So actually when you're using a leather line, it should be clear. Fluorocarbon. No color guys. So that the fish will bite easily. So that they cannot see. So this is for the sake of demonstration only. I'm using this green. So that you can see properly what I'm what I am doing okay to tie this one so without further ado let's start source okay <coughs> first you take braid line okay like this and then tie it into your fingers here yeah, I will roll it up here how many turns? Okay, so okay, like this. Okay, I'm wrapping these two fingers here. Just like this. And then before I begin, like this. Okay, from top. Like this. And then up and down so first and then the other side under over under only repeated action guys repeated pattern up and then down by pulling this to lubricate it with my saliva a little so that it will be nice and clean you pull it give it tension so after that hold it and then tie a half hitch half hitch guys That's the first half hitch. And then another one. Then another half hitch. Then pull it. Give attention. Okay. And then pull this one. The leather line and the main line. Okay. Now it is tight. Like that. So it's not the final guys. For me, my final knot for closing this gap or oh, this knot so that it will be stronger I use risotto knot as a lock so that your leather line and the main line is very strong especially when you're casting so many times it will not broke up so like this you make a loop like this A bigger loop okay then wrap this one here wrap it wrap it 
with six times six reps six to seven reps okay just like that and then you transfer all the reps counterclockwise counter counter guys you rub it down once transfer all as you can see here it transferred to the reverse counter it you just reverse it what you have done So as you can see here, all the wraps is transfer here. So lubricate it. And then pull here. That again here. So that it will be close. Slowly. 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 Slowly down then lock it put pressure and then pull together your main line and your leader line so that it will be locked and steady So now it is locked, it's locked, it's very tight and thin. Then you can cut now the tag ends, the axis. For me, I will burn the remaining here a little bit, burn it so that it will be clean and the end of the burn will give a lock also support here to support and then here also you do the same, you leave a little and then burn it so that it will be clean up to here okay it look like this look like this so just like that this is how i do my fg nut without a tensioner just a finger only pardon me guys it's difficult to to tie it while taking a video so i tried my best to tie it successfully by watching the camera beside me and then doing this it's very hard to pull guys it's very strong so this is how i do it in my way it will not broke how many times I tie like this? The most important thing is the lock, guys. Many of you will be successful in in tying the if G nut, but if you have hitch only, it will broke. And this is the risotto nut. The lock. It's very strong. It will not broke. I hope it can help you guys and tight lines God bless bye bye